The annual RFCI Relay for Life took place on Friday, May 25th. This annual relay has really been a great success story for the students of RCI. Uh, this is our 12th annual Relay for Life. Um, it's an event that happens the last Friday of May every year and it celebrates us raising money to defeat cancer, it brings together the school, the community, and we work together to raise as much money as we can. While the day is one to honor those who fight their cancer battles and also remember those who lost their lives, it's also a day for kids to celebrate the cancer victories and have a little fun on the side. I think the kids have a great time. They're having fun on the inflatables, doing all that stuff. I think it hits them when they see the survivors walk around at six and when they do the luminary ceremony, that I think they get that feeling in the pit of their stomach that says, oh yeah, this is why we're actually doing this. Because it's easy to raise money, it's easy to do those things, but when you actually see the survivors and you see the people that have been affected, that's when you really get your big difference. The relay is also a great way to help teach kids throughout their high school careers that it's always important to give back to the community that you live in. I mean, yeah, cancer will affect one in two people in Canada, so that's one of the big things is that we don't do a lot of hounding on don't quit smoking, don't do this, don't do that, but it's really the idea that get out, recognize that we have to raise money for this disease, it's going to affect you likely at some point in your life, or at least somebody in your family. So it's important to get out, be involved, and just don't sit back and get out and make a difference. I'm a big believer, and I tell my social justice kids all the time, that you need to be able to step, walk the walk and talk the talk. So if I'm asking my kids to get out and volunteer, I'm going to be in the trenches beside them showing what happens. And I think my parents were both big volunteers, and it's ideas that if you want to get out and make a difference, you have to be the one willing to put your time forward and dedicate yourself to making the world a better place. This year, they had the goal to raise $90,000. The school is no stranger to hitting high marks. For Kojigo News in Renfrew, I'm Richard Leboy.